Good morning, I'm Michael from Moat Monster Gaming, and if you enjoy the video, please like and subscribe. So today I'm opening G.I. Joe Classified Destro. Um, I'm super excited to open him because I have been a massive, massive Joe fan for 40 odd years. Um, so I had Action Force when I was a kid, um, and then these rather bland figures turned into these very exciting Z-Force and uh, the Red Shadows. But ultimately, when I want to say Palitoy got bought out by Hasbro, they started then turning Action Force into these guys that were more articulate. And of the original ones, other than Scrap Iron, Destro was my favourite and there he is squatting on the back of this Action Force card. Um, now unfortunately my Destro hasn't stood the test of time, his O-ring went and he's now separated in two um, but still have the gun, still have the pack and he was one of my favourite characters. Though I must say at the time I didn't realise that was his chest, I assumed he had like a pinky vest on. But there we go. So um, I remember reading about him in Battle. Uh, he's the Battle uh, Action Force Annual. And there's Destro on the front. Um, but then this swiftly changed and Marvel took control of it. And again, such a popular villain Destro was. There he is on the front cover of, this was the 86 uh annual and this is the 87 Destro still prominently on the front um, and featuring heavily in the inside there is featuring heavily inside um, now here's his entry from the order of battle and what I do think is interesting is obviously this order of battle so old he's a uh, file his uh, real name unknown but I'm going to have a quick look on the back of the card. Here we go. I really do like that the classified uh, retro versions have the old style uh, information card at the back. Actually does have his name as James uh, McCullen, which we know. Um, so he's not my first. So obviously I had this one old and unfortunately broken, but one day I'll fix him. Um, but I do have the already have the 91, I'm going to say, reissue that they did. Uh, head, not as shiny as uh, this one. I think I prefer the shiny head on that one, but at least this one's got proper eyes and you can see from the metal mask. Um, and he's he's a great, he was a great figure back at the time. And then I had this not so great one, and this is the Star Brigade one. Um, I think Star Brigade was when the line was really starting to fail, but back to shiny, shiny head. So here is the six inch G.I. Joe classified version. Um, and where it's in the retro packaging, I am actually really sad that I'm gonna open him, but I do really wanna display him on the shelf uh, in various action poses. Um, and I haven't got the others, but I definitely wanna get Baroness as well because she was such an awesome figure as a kid. I, I, in fact, I wanna get all of them, they're all great, they're all great. So, I do like this, I do like the picture on the side. Um, so, here he is, let's open him up. So hopefully I've opened him up carefully enough to not ruin the packet too much, because it's still a very nice packet. Okay, so comes with a Cobra base, which is nice. Wish they all came with a base. And then I'll do his accessories first. So we have got uh, his arms dealer case. And does it open? Yes, it does. It does. It has money uh, and it has a Mars computer inside. So that's a nice little touch because that's quite similar to... His, there's his weapons attaché, or his, his weapons case before, but this is cool with money and Cobra logo on it. And we have pistol with a scope. That's quite cool. And then a smaller pistol. So I'm sure that's the one that would go in his holster. 
and then onto the figure. Oh, he looks excellent. I've been excited to open him for ages. So uh, there he is, head turns, as you would expect. Nice uh, movement on the neck as well as the head. And then, oh, there we go. And then uh, the jewellery piece comes off. Nice big, big collar, like the 91 one. And then nice, it's got the rotating arm socket that I often think the Marvel Legends miss out rotating. They're the going backwards and form forwards arm socket. I think he's very, very cool. Uh, nice flex movement in the chest. Quite, you can really stretch back. You can limbo. Um, and then we have nice belt. Uh, that looks like it's got plenty of movement on it. Boots look cool. Hopefully his feet move nicely. His feet do move nicely. I always think it's sometimes a pain when they don't move as well as they should do. Uh, yeah, I think he's excellent. I look forward to posing him with the others. Thank you very much for watching. Take, oh, he's got rockets on his, he's got rockets on his, uh, on his arm. That's quite cool. Didn't spot that. Thank you very much for watching. Take care. Oh. <sighs>